Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Coliseum. In the last part, we won the Pokemon Coliseum thingy majiggy. Wow, oh, really? So you really want to enter one at all? It'll be my turn next. Just keep telling yourself that, man. You've got things to do. Hi there, you must be the superb trader who has uh, emerged triumphant in our latest battle challenge. Mira V, the town's true mover and shaker, wishes you to have a gorgeous gift. Now follow me. What's with these doors here? Yeah, look at them, they're weird looking. What kind of doors are these? Who's always have these weird kind of places. Right, I'm back with our latest challenge, champion. Let's present our lucky winner with a shadow Pokemon and watch chaos unleashed. <laughs> oh, nice one. Our new champ is quite the appealing charmer. Makes a nice change from the parade of Macho Muscle Man. Wait, this isn't happening. This guy. Is that Michael guy that Mirror B had been carrying our on about? What? The same guy who messed with us in Phoenix City? Ah, I didn't know that when I let him in here. I'll put you back out. Pokeballs are going across the screen. Cypher Beyond No More. Would like to battle you. What do you got? I think we might have a shadow button. We'll have to wait and see. That's the thing. You can never fully tell, but I think a lot of the trainers do tend to have a shadow button. Yep, I thought so, it's Yanko. Yep. Oh, there's a Shadow Pokemon. Yeah, I had a feeling when he, when I, I saw like him using Yanma, I was like, there was a Shadow Yanma in this game. And then he was like, yep. Like, off screen in the battle seems kind of pointless in this kind of game, you know? Like, if it was like any other Pokemon game, fair enough, but most of the trainers have Shadow Pokemon. So it's like, on screen, I'm just trying to get the Shadow Pokemon. I'm gonna try Secret Power on that Yanma. I'm gonna try to get that Yanma. Like, even if like, you fail to catch any Shadow Pokemon in this game, you'll always get another chance to catch so at some other point in time in the game. I can't remember with this one. Actually, I think I do, actually. There's an area where, like, there are a lot of Cypher Peons that do that appear that, like, bring the like, that Shadow Pokemon that is kind of, like, not so bad for the first time around. Every level is here. Now it's freaking upgraded from level up to the level of this one. Okay, I'm sorry, Ninkata, but we're gonna focus all our attacks on you, because I think Yanma is probably gonna eventually use our Shadow Rush and Reject to itself. No. Good. Imagine if they all submitted. Actually, I'm not sure. I might actually work. Try it out. Oh shit! Didn't think you wanted on it. Be careful, up front. You might actually knock out the Pokemon and run and catch. Maybe you'll get more than that. Good. Just get I don't know. That's good! Yeah, I mean, that's the job of you. Well, you think there'd be the possibility of it, but nope. Oh, I'm going to take the beating. Now, watch out, man.
How about you then? I don't stand a chance of winning. Now hold on, you're the one who brought him here. Idiots. Oh, you're safe. I heard you entered this building. It had me worried. He's just like, what the fuck are you doing here? Duking, this is where they are. We're giving Shadow Pokemon to the winners of battle challenges. Shadow Pokemon? Those ferocious Pokemon that even attack people? Yes, just stealing away. Giving away Shadow Pokemon to Fugs for some reason, it doesn't look good. Bruh, they are using the Colosseum to do that! Big Lady, my papa, papa's Pokemon has been taken away by Mirabi as a prisoner. He did what? Mirabi used a dirty move like that? Oh really, did you really expect him not use dirty tactics? It's papa's Plessel. I'm so worried that he might be mean to it, that they might be mean to it. It's humiliating, but with Plusle in their filthy hands, my own hands are tied. He's not getting away with this, that rotten mirror be. But you're here now, we will get Plusle back, back for you, right, my own. Well, it's just like a thou must moment regardless, but yeah, you'd agree to it, well, I would anyway. <laughs> I knew I could always count on you, my own. You can get dangerous inside this building. You've got to get everyone out of here safe at the safety. Thanks for everything. I have to depend on you. I have no choice. Be careful always. Mira B might ha look like a clown, but his battling is all business. I will found an e Ian vial. Ian vial H is written on the files. Cover, read it. Hyper mode. Shadow Pokemon perhaps because of their own overwhelming power may behave abnormally at times. They may engage in such behavior as ignoring orders, even turning on their own trainers in battle. This I have named Hyper Mode. On the plus side, Hyper Mode raises the critical radio of Shadow Rush. However, Hyper Mode also prevents the use of items on the Pokemon. Hyper Mode is easily to spell, simply call the Pokemon by name. However, this method has a major drawback. Calling a shadow Pokemon name causes the closed door of its heart to loosen and even open. Fellow research is urgently needed. Shadow Pokemon Lab Chief Ian. So yeah, that's pretty much like I'd already knew about that because I played through this game, but yeah, you call a Pokemon and stuff like that. But if battling with a Pokemon like opens its heart over time, then surely that's a flaw in the whole thing entirely anyway, because even if you give it to Fugs, their heart will eventually open up a bit more because they'll be like battling. And battling is supposed to like open the door to its heart. Oh shit. I didn't get to go there. What do you think you're doing here? I'm gonna have to kick your ass. But I'm gonna switch out Umbrin because Umbrin's tired. We need to heal up. Is that a shadow Pokemon? 
was there an off tower? I think it might be an off tower or a roof. I can't remember if it's a church or an off tower. No. He doesn't have to remember what he's doing. Okay. I'll give him a bite. I'm not going to eat over it. I haven't seen a bad rule in a while. Not that this LP is really gone on for all of them. I've never saved that. It's been a while now. It's been a while in terms of like I haven't played this game for quite some time. Well, the previous part of my was recorded right before the start of the game. But before that, it's like quite a bit of a long fall between. It's getting pumped! Side. The only thing that tax on the road is absolutely, absolutely nothing for them in the long run. Not Aerial Ace! Oh shit, Aerial Ace! Oh crap, forgot about that. Whoa! I'm not going to flat out in one shot. Well, what? The assistant splits. Process. If it like goes out of sync or anything like that, I'll be able to tell that it does so if I even pay attention to it when editing anyway. Or I'm no match, I must level up some more. Right, we need to heal some more, is more like it. We've pretty much got all six, we got like a freaking whole team of six Pokemon now, haven't we? That's neat. Wait, no, let's not go up here, not yet. Excuse me, okay? Trying to walk past you. Challenge you. Too bad for you, the elevator is off limits. Kai! That clearly has a I don't think you have a shadow book in the house. But, you know, just, just for excellent sake, I guess. Well, no, so it will like end up like we just have to go back and forth, healing up and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, up, Brian. Michael. Nice one. Why do they always do that? Like, identify them. It's just like, there's no point in you using those. Now, sand attack, that's... That makes sense, because that decreases our accuracy. That's... That actually makes sense to use, but, like, attacks to identify a Pokemon aren't that supposed to be used only on dope Pokemon. You use them on, like, any ordinary Pokemon. Like, that isn't a ghost type. It's a creation boost for a when it is a ghost type, I still don't even know what the hell purpose that would be so to this day, I still don't get the purpose. Unlike you get like, 
the stuff like stuff and stuff like that. Kind of like, I can't remember where it does this now, but in some form of the game, you can like attract Pokemon. That's it. Echo, you're really noisy. This didn't happen. But it did, my dear. It did. And you lost miserably. A lot quicker than the other kid. No matter what, this elevator is off limits. Really? We kicked your ass, but you still won't let us use the elevator. It's the elevator to the basement. The door's locked. Oh yeah, we're gonna need a key to use the elevator. The vending machine is out of order. It's not like it's out of order, more it's trashed. So technically it is out of order, it's trashed. Back here. I would like uh, a Dr. Pepper, please. No. Screw you. Prep the tango next time. <laughs> My Pokemon are looking for their chance to go wild. Booyah! And then a guy. Yes. I don't know why, but you know, like a stereotypical kind of a top kind of thing. Just like that was like just one just like looking at this guy just like that's a stereotypical way people like think they look like you know I don't know about the bandana but it's you know it tends to be a thing isn't it? got a lava tar there so too good for that still how about we try out Yanma? You get like people that would like say that they're an otaku even if they don't speak Japanese and stuff like that, and they're just like, I wouldn't consider myself that. I, I mean, I consider myself just some random otaku introvert. With like a lot of like the creepy type of otaku, you can see why people like would want to be associated with the like that. It's like now, now I just like anime and manga and games. Now I'm Why do I even talk about random things like that? I always read articles where they're like, just like freaking a talk to and they're just like awfully obsessed with anime characters so they know exactly and they're like idols and stuff like that. And they're like, what the fuck, man? I don't really pay attention to stuff like that, really. At all. Ow! Oh wait, Carvana. Carvana, no, uh, that's the one where you attack it, and if it's like a physical attack, it hits you back. This is also a rock type, this game. That, that one's just going for it. No hyper mode, nothing. Holy shit! That one is tough. Bad play, Jan, not bad play. That Stop crashing me! Ow! Owie! Ow! as well, depending on the level of the Pokemon. Oh yeah, Secret Tower is the physical attack, isn't it? Just realized that. I want to go wilder! Go live in the wild, then. That's about as wild as you can get, right? My Pokemon don't like to be gone wild enough, but I'll let you off just with just this, this time. A 
normal, uh, normalty detected target locked on. Under the... They always have these type of names just like, kind of like, put together like a word for some other random metal. Like, what? That's like, that's not even a real name, is it? You can have a Detected in friendly Pokemon. What? Whatever you say, man. Whatever you say. There's something back there. Inside, Yuki. I'm gonna sit here. I'm just gonna do some paperwork. My beloved Pokemon, see? <laughs> Fresh prey. Ah, bring it on, Baba. Yeah, I'm just gonna on screen every battle because you know why not? Quite, they're more interesting than, you know, single battles, single 
that that kind of snail on Maybe I should have named you when I give the after an upgrade in here. You already get the good summons. Oh man, it was a tough one. Uh, I rarely use that freezing things, even if it's for defense. Swift. Loving Pokemon are all beat up. There's a machine to heal them up downstairs. It's only consolation. Found a great ball. There are five of them. Nice. We got a bargain sale here for absolutely nothing. The shelves are lined with apparently, diff uh, apparently difficult books. What are these difficult books? Okay, we'll face this guy and then we'll pull him apart after that. You're like bug Pokemon drawn to a candle. I'm going with these Pokemon. These guys have such an odd body shape, don't they? It's just like their legs look tiny compared to their upper half. Better use a sparrow than have a tiny He's trying to compensate for something. Very strong at all. Yep, you're not very strong, dude. Look at that Voltorb, man, he looks pissed. Ah! That's not gonna do you any good, because I'll make sure that this next turn will be your last, mighty boy! Uh, no super power attack. Confusion! Oh, you need the quick attack! That mildly hurts. Confusion! Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah. Well, I like how in these battles, just kind of like a train, just stand on a spot awkwardly as the Pokemon do battle. Like in the world of Pokemon, it's like Pokemon do everything while everyone else just kind of stands and over. Like, as soon as your Pokemon defeat, you're like, No, I'm defenseless now, I can't do anything. It's like, dude, you're a bodybuilder for crying out loud. This wasn't good enough. This is such a clever. I mean, you'd think, like, he just lets, he'll just let us pass because we kicked his ass. And it's just like, just because we defeated his Pokemon, it's just like, I mean, you've fucking got all that freaking muscle and stuff. No glory for the fallen, I'm crushed. Maybe that's his reason. No, if we leave this place right now and come back, basically every trainer we've fought would challenge us again. That's how it works in this game. Well, anyways, though, I'm gonna call it a part here and we'll continue our journey through this area. So see you next time, dude. See you next time.